Welcome aboard, I'm Jason Navargo, and this is Resident Evil 2. It literally just came out. There has never been a Resident Evil 2 before this one. The funky thing is, technically, I am right. This game really needs no introduction. It's basically one of the most famous video games ever created. Since Leon is first in the list, then we will do his scenario first, and then we will do Claire's, probably, if uh, this series does well enough. But uh, let's go ahead and just jump in. Standard, of course. Let's shoot some spooks. I want to shoot some spooks. Come on, Leon. Help me out. Hey, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse. Like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, it'll sink to teeth and build Oh, come on. Just getting good. You should probably ask her. She, she looks like she knows exactly what to do. Oh, here we go. Leon the cool kid. I like how this is definitely sort of a slow burn kind of opening. Like... Like, this is definitely building up to what's coming. I like that. around I hope that wasn't your squad car can you imagine like being this actually being your very first day on the oh we're starting Explore your surroundings, but can you imagine this actually being your first day on the job as a cop? Huh? Well, I am a policeman There's a sound of breaking glass inside of the gas station that is open. I wonder if I should indeed go in Well, um uh, This is the police open up, please Hello Anybody there? Hmm. I'll just take this and go. Something's not right. Something? <laughs> what was your first clue, Leon? I can see why you're on the beat and not like a detective or something. Like, <laughs> something's not right is probably one of the very first things that people say when it's very obvious that nothing at all is right. Oh my gosh. They're just leaving all the beer out to get warm. I hear somebody sniveling. Hey, 
buckaroo. You all right? You don't sound like a zombie. Don't move. I'll be back for you. Okay. You just you you you're pointing. Tim me down in the well. Uh, something I should know. You should probably inform me about the situation before I head in there. And okay, I'm gonna stop being such a little, such a little scaredy cat. What, sir? Hey, whoa. Okay, was that a trick? Was am I actually bait for this guy? Wow, that's a dick move if I ever saw one. Also, you need help? Uh, stay back, sir. I got this. Uh, uh, hey, uh, 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 Freeze! I'll shoot. Uh, yeah, I will. I will definitely shoot. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that letting go of the guy that you're wrestling with and is trying to bite you, that's that's probably a career-ending decision, officer. Just gonna be frank with you, that was that was definitely not a wise thing to do. Like he's <laughs> pinning down a horrible monster that's trying to rip him open with his bare hands, and he's like, "Don't worry, I got this. You stay right there." Oh boy, that's why people die. That's why I survive, because I do not get distracted. At all. Not at all. Okay. Time to move. <laughs> Inventory. I got my keys. And it's getting back up. Oh, that's just great. I'll just leave you to it then. You got you got plenty of food back there, so you know, I'll just uh Hey, what are you doing? Buddy? Are you are you Do you understand Do you understand the severity of the situation? There is a certain, there is a certain, uh, uh, solemnity to all this that I don't think you're getting. Or maybe I can just kind of juke past him. Hey, follow the light. And let me just, nope, there's no juking past him at all. Ah. Yeah, see, if the other guy had just done that, then he would have been fine. Is there any way I can close the door? There's got to be a, oh, wait a minute. There's more. Hey, okay, here's the key. Use that. Excellent. Hey, that guy looks fine. Everybody looks fine. This, this is such a fun time we're all having here at the gas station. Ow. Back off. I am a cop. Oh, 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 oh. Where did you even come from? He wasn't there when I looked when I was when I last looked. Hey, you picked the exact wrong time to enter this building. You all right? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later when we're safe. Holy shit. <laughs> She's like, come on, he says, leading her directly into the horde. There was about there was about 18 different ways that they could both have just died there, and they somehow managed to avoid all of them. What the hell is going on? I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah. Leon Kennedy. You are? A drug runner. I mean, what? Clear Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop, too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Everybody in Raccoon City a cop? Full disclosure, never actually finished Resident Evil 2, at least the original. Only played it at a friend's place once. 
but I am all about these modern remakes. Old classics coming back with remastered controls and better graphics. I am just... Oof. That is the dream, man. Is that hunk? I know we get to play as him at some point. And also a block of tofu, if I remember correctly. Resident Evil 2. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Oh sure, just tell all the zombies where we're gonna be. Oh my god, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Uh, Leon, that's a lot of... There has to be. Don't be silly. There's someone standing right there. Looks like we're walking from here. Hey, is that a zombie? More like running. Yeah, good call. Never seen a zombie before. Oh, there's one. Yeah, that's definitely one. You gotta back up. Yeah, the, the car is running, Leon. And he's. Uh oh. Uh oh. Holy shit. There, get out. Get out now! I can't. Hold on! Oh. Oh! I just realized nobody was wearing their seatbelt. That's probably the most worrisome thing about this entire situation. I'm sure there's some survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Oh, it's big city survivors. Yeah. I'll just go find another cute girl. Claire! Claire, are you okay? Yeah. I'm alright. How about you? Well, I'm, I'm pretty fine. I look good when I'm wet. Can't stay here. It's not safe. Go on ahead. I mean, you should I'm see me. I'm honestly really I'll be handsome. There. Oh my god. Oh, okay, good. This is out of control. <laughs> this is whack, man. These zombies are out of control. That's right up that's right up there with hang in there, Leon. I'm gonna enjoy hearing your voice acting. Alright. Obviously I do not have enough bullets to take care of all these guys, and that is the wrong way to go. So there's a good spot. Everybody, they all turned. Okay, okay, okay. This is really cool. Loving the atmosphere. There it is, the station. Well, this situation looks like it's completely under control. Just gotta juke all these guys. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, you made it. I was gonna, I was here to cheer you on. Leon, the great motivator. It's a big city. I'm sure there's survivors for you guys to eat and me to find. Whew. Welcome to the city of the dead. Population U. Hey, where's my cop uniform? Do I not? Oh, that's, that's that's cool. He's got he's got that little uh, reaction to being wet. Hello? Is anybody here? Oh, he's got the bite mark on his neck. 
Is that ever gonna go away, or does like damage stay on your clothes? Because that'd be pretty cool. Good old first aid spray. Let's check that out. Oh, I remember this from the demo. There has to be someone here. Not good. David, Marvin, you there? I found a way out. It's in here. In that little notebook? I don't think we're all gonna fit in there, buddy. Send reinforcements. East hallway. The reinforcements meeting yourselves. I gotta find that guy. Maybe he can maybe he can help me with my hair physics. All right, that is a lockbox. There's a save station. I don't have any. Oh. I'm pretty sure in hardcore you have to have like a sheet of paper to type in the typewriter. But since we're just doing standard, then I can just do whatever. I have no there's no risk. No risk, but still but great reward. I could be as careless as I want. I can leave, I can leave blood splatters all over the floor. Are those my footprints? I'm pretty sure I saw myself <laughs> leaving bloody shoe prints, which is pretty cool. Yes, it is. That is cool. That's really cool. I hope they stick around. The, the footprints, not the zombies that I just heard outside. Let's move. I already know how this ends. Yeah, that looks like a really welcoming area. Okay, yeah, that's, that's, that's really grody, Leon. Just go ahead and wipe it all over your front. Deja vu. Okay. Okay. If anyone asks Leon, it's casual Friday. I really wish he was wearing his uniform, though. Like, wouldn't that be just the coolest thing if you could actually, like, find his police uniform and put it on? He could, like, suit up like Isaac Clark or something. You got this, he says. You got this as he fails the first quick time event in the game. All right. All right, I know what to do. I will immediately go, to, I say as I immediately go into the women's bathroom, I know what to do. I've done this before. Don't worry. I'm a cop. Yeah, there's the water all over the floor. Why is the men's bathroom boarded up that way? Is there a zombie in there? Man, all this hog in the toilets. Okay, so, I remember. Jesus. Yeah, that's pretty great, isn't it? Oh, no. I remember after this part, Open I immediately just I'll get you out. book it back to the entrance. Please, give me your hand. Me. I got you. Wow, maybe this time he'll survive. No, I was immediately wrong, proven wrong about that. Hang in there, hang in there. That <laughs> good old motivator. Are you motivated yet? I'm a cop. Serve and protect. Hang in there. Still not motivated. My man, you really need to work on your positive reinforcement. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Those are the those are the well they're not really clues, they're just answers to that uh, that statue puzzle that I found. Alright, now I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure if I do that. Yeah, I can stagger him. Which is great. Which is really good news. That's super good for me. So, if you don't mind, I'll just be leaving. Jesus. They're everywhere. Yeah, I'll just be leaving. Oh! Oh, oh wait, I forgot there was a guy in there. Whoa. Okay, we're just gonna go. Dang, I almost got out without getting hit again. I like how they keep fighting the exact same spot. Like eventually it'll work. Good old Marvy man. 
Bam! That's how you do it. You're safe. For now. <laughs> At least until I also turn into a zombie. Marvin Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I couldn't... If only I had that kitty poster, man. Words are not enough sometimes. Here. I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. That was oddly condescending. I'm sure Anyone you did what you could. This? Not a clue. Oh, there it is! But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Mm. This is good news. We can get you to hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. You take it out, or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. <laughs> Hang in there, Marvin. All right, so, uh, I know what that is. Oh, let's go solve that other puzzle. Sorry, Marvin, don't mean to fill up my inventory and run, but I've already done this. You are already dead. This is not how I imagined my first day. Ha, <laughs> shucks, right, Leon? I've had those kinds of days. Everyone's had those kinds of days. First day on the job and suddenly you have to deal with the zombie apocalypse. Where is that notebook? Uh, you know, okay, yeah, I know that. I know that. Where is it? Uh, lion, twig, and birdie bird. And that, and that, and birdie bird. Nice. Lion medallion. Hey, Marvin, you wouldn't believe the slot machines that they got in this place. Do they ever actually explain why all the all this ridiculous stuff is here? Oh, well, that's uh. Elliot was right. Yeah. The passage. <laughs> you knew open. about this. Why is it this just open? <laughs> like, wouldn't somebody just be like, you know, you know, I, there is that whole thing about the the police station being built on a secret. James Bond villain base. Maybe we should take advantage of that. Oh, why am I going up here again? I need to go back down to the... Okay. That was oddly specific and ominous. Did you guys hear how the music just really picked up? A really spooky choir. Uh, they just warm it up for the big event. Combined with that. Extra reload. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. Reception! I'm here for the new officer training seminar. Hello? Huh. I remember this hallway. Yep, this is the dude that got taken out by slashers. Oof, I love the effects on the gore. It's so <laughs> lifelike. What? Huh? What? Could I 
Could I not be alone here? Could there be zombies? Are you a zombie? Was he a zombie? Am I a zombie? Oh, right. There's that boarding up mechanic, which we will definitely need to take advantage of. Hi. <laughs> I don't like you. Well, I don't like, I don't like you either. Record of events, returning the station to a temporary shelter. la di da di da apocalypse log. And, ooh, is this the map? Yep, yeah, it's the map. Nice. Let's continue going through, let's not continue going through here. Let's go back out through here. Well, no, oh God. <laughs> I ran right into her. Eat this. Eat this. Ah, it's no use. I want my knife back, so I'm gonna have to pop her. There you go. I'd oh, for Pete's sake. Oof. Are you dead yet? Oh my god, are you serious? I just wanted my knife back, lady. Why you gotta, why you gotta be, okay, that's definitely. Can I just, oh, for Pete's sake. Oh, for Pete's sake. That's gross. She is st <laughs> still not. That is a stubborn zombie. It must be one of those special zombies that have, like, particularly high resistance to bullets. Okay. There's another friendly officer. Having trouble with the having trouble with the vending machines. Hank, you look like a Hank. I'll leave you to it, Hank. Ooh, more stuff. Uses of gunpowder. Two gunpowder is one handgun ammo. Gunpowder and high grade is shotgun. Mag ammo, two high grade gunpowder. All right, all right, all right, all right. That's just the one. Now I'm definitely gonna need more. Inventory space at some point. So hopefully I can mess with that. I don't know how to open that. There's definitely going to be a lot of backtracking. Because there's a lot of stuff that I still cannot interact with. Alright. Rookie's first assignment. Leon, we're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Wow, jeez, you guys must have been really bored before the zombie outbreak. It's like a buildup of boredom until, like, the universe finally decided, you know what, you guys need some excitement in your life. It has been, like, 30 years of messing with, with new recruits by asking them to solve stupid little puzzles. So here's a zombie outbreak. There are two locks, one on each side of you. Why are there two locks? Make sure you get them both. Your task is to remember your fellow officers' names. But you figured that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Is that... What does that mean? Scrawled in a corner between drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. <laughs> oh, boy. David Ford. Wait a minute. What did he say? I already forgot the clue. The initials of our first names. D... Uh-oh. Ah, I can't believe it. N-E-D, Ned. Okay. Hi. Uh, I'm solving the puzzle you guys gave me. I'm a good rookie. Yeah, you just come around here. And I will... Oh, hi. Oh, what, what, what? Is that... Wait, wait, no, no, that's not... That's no. hole. That's, that's not... That's not cool. That's not cool. Back. I need more time. What was it? Uh, R M. So something R M. Oh, good. It's paused. I got all the time in the world. There we go. This little brute force. Nice. High capacity mag. Can I just? Yes, I can. Yes. Sweet. Okay. So now that could hold even more bullets. Which I can plug uselessly at more zombies. 
That's locked. That's great. That's really interesting. How the heck am I supposed to get out of this one? Oh man, so many hijinks between me and my fellow officers. <laughs> what way? Okay. Um, that's locked. Oh, hi! Oh, no, no, no. No, thank you. I don't already solved the stupid puzzle. I did not know that it was employee friendly this day. Where am I supposed to go now? That was, that was, this is the exact wrong way to go. All right. No choice, gotta make a stand. Oh, critical hit, God nice. Damn it. Uh, okay, great. Now let me get the knife back from him. And I'll just be going. Safety deposit room. All right. There's something in here. It's the. Wait. I don't have the. I don't have the key card. Where's the key card supposed to go? I know there is one around here somewhere. There's a weapons locker key card somewhere in this building. I think it was back in the uh, the office. Ah, oh, great. Okay. Okay. This is gonna be. This is gonna be tough. You guys could just follow me around here, like so. Right, like that, and then that'll give me time to slip around to safety. To woo. Uh, dark room. All oh, right, this is where the uh, the stairs are. So. And that's where that is. Which means, if I am quick, I can say no to zombies. Bam. That'll hold it. Cool. I will definitely combine you two. To make extra powerful, to make some of that extra dank kush. And I will save. Okay. Yes. Woo. Oh. Okay. I don't know why, but it seems a little bit more challenging than last time. All right, the lockers. Yeah, nice. Okay, great. So that was very helpful. And now we're not what? Let's go ahead and drop that in there. And can I combine it? Nope, I can only combine two herbs at a time. In that case, let's drop that in there as well. And Wait a minute. This is the st <laughs> this is the gas station storage room key. I am not gonna need that. There's got to be other lockers out there that I need to check. So, were there any in that? Uh... Huh? Hello? Somebody need my help? Oh no, you I, you you look like you got the situation well in hand. So. Right, locker room. Oh, 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 that one got me that time. You're not a zombie, are you? Nope, but you do look like you got Oreos stuck in your hair. What is that? Oh, the shotgun shells. Great. I don't have a shotgun just yet, but that's going to change very soon. Portable safe? What? Examining items. Uh, okay. Let's examine that. Wait a minute. Oh, it's one of these things. I say, having never encountered anything like this before in my life. Okay, so the position never changes. So what I need to do is I need to bring it all the way around. That one, that one, that one, and then this one. And then I believe that one is this. No? This one. This one. That one. Hey! <laughs> it even gives you a congratulatory jingle. Congratulations on breaking into someone's private property. A small key of some sort. I'm gonna hang on to that one. Yep. Oh, I find the instructions after I solve the puzzle. That's just how I be. 
I'm just I'm just really good at puzzles like that. Obviously, I'm gonna have to find a part to this thing. Okay, I still haven't found a weapons locker key card, which is problematic. Let me just let me just. Yeah, that's totally a non-lethal takedown, right? I am a good cop. I am concerned about the safety of the people around me. That's why I shoot them in the kneecaps. Ah, so many, so many padlocks everywhere. You know what? Just to preempt any sp Oh, that didn't work at all. Is it like rooted to the desk in time and space? Ooh, I know where to use that key. Now, in the demo, there were no lurkers. So, I'm gonna trust you, game. What in the I'm gonna trust you. I'm gonna trust you hard, even though I probably shouldn't. To not throw lurkers at me in like the first 10 minutes of the game. I don't have enough for that. Um, let's go ahead and use that since I just need a medium amount of health. I think this will come in handier than the gunpowder. That's not a, okay. That's not an actual storage thing. What the heck is that? That is a spooky ass statue. Ooh, and a pouch. A small belted pouch, good for carrying more items, and is fashionable. Some guy's scribblings. They cut me off after all I've done for them. All I, wait, I boarded all those filthy pigs up in a, th in a steel pen and set some C4. All I gotta do is detonate it. But it's no fun if it's over too soon, so I'll give that one raving loon something to really squeal about. Yeah, maybe give him a little toy and tell him kill the guy next to you and I'll spare the others. Yeah, you're such a good cop. So good you had to die. This is fun. I need some music for this. Well, uh, um, okay. Okay, apparently the zombies kind of, uh, kind of, uh, messed up that plan. Can I shoot it? I don't think shooting C4... Yeah, shooting C4 doesn't actually detonate it in real life. There's a lot of jingling and jangling going on out that I really don't care for. Ooh. Leon, it's Marvin. I need you back here ASAP. Are you okay, Marvin? I've got something to show you. It's Are you okay, he I'll says. I'll be right having there. seen Marvin... Barely holding his intestines in. Whoa! Okay. That was that was some jabating right there. No, don't hold on to that. Hold on to your heart. Let's just get out of here. Oh, wait. I know this one. Fish scorpion amphora. Fish. Scorpion. Vaz. Excellent. I always did like unicorns. Oh, they're still coming after me. Oh, wait, what's that? More gunpowder. Uh, you know, yeah, let's go ahead and take it just in case. Because I feel. Oh, for Pete's sake, what the. What? 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 That was a critical hit. That was a miss. And now what? Police station, upper floor map. Okay, so that's definitely a lot. I gotta get back in the library. <gasps> There's a spade door. Okay. These zombies sound so terrifying. The sound design in this game is great. Everything is pretty great. That looks really handy. Um, but I can't pick it up right now. So let's just come back for it later. Hey, Marvin. I may or may not have a giant army of zombies on my tail. Sorry about that. There you are. Come here. Take a look. Yes. I knew she'd make it. I knew she'd call Marvin? me back. 
She yeah. just couldn't resist. I came into town with her. She's basically my girlfriend. Into that courtyard, through the second floor, east side. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. Never had a girlfriend before. You were an excellent wingman. I'll be sure to put in a good word for you. Yeah, now there's a now there's a spade door. Okay. Uh, oh right. I should actually go back. Hey, Marvin, I'm back. I just uh, I know I just said goodbye to you like five seconds ago, but um, I just had to like uh, just had to slip that in there. Okay. Okay. Uh, that was probably really awkward. So I'm just gonna just gonna pop on out of here again. See ya. Guide pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. <laughs> Did you know? Ah! We're all getting killed by zombies. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few more of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer, like zombies. Orphanage. Oh, well, I'm sure nothing horrifying happened there. Nothing bad ever happens to orphans. Am I right or am I right? I can open that. And where am I now? Art room. Oh, boy. Um... There's the key card to the locker, and I still don't have enough inventory space. Great. The red stone. Bunch of stuff that I don't care about. Um, I'm going to have to go back, get to a save point, and get myself some storage space so that I can actually... <laughs> There's a lot of quest important items. Absolutely vital items that you need to keep track of. And so it's going to lead to a lot of rather awkward backtracking, I think. Hi again, Marvin. Don't worry about me. Can you imagine being poor Marvin? You're just sitting there dying from a gaping wound in your stomach, and Leon is just running back and forth looking like a dork. Just like, hey, sorry, Marvin. I just realized I just found the blue spade key, and it goes to that door over there. And I'm on my way to fetch the red, the red ruby stone, which I can slot into that medallion statue over there. Haven't found any bandages yet, but, uh, you know, hang in there. Anyway, I just saved my game. I've been playing for almost an hour. I hope you guys have been enjoying it. I know I have. This is a lot of fun. I do intend to finish. Calm. Zombies are high water. But do leave a like if you enjoyed this video. And remember, I am in War Man, you are Captain. And me and my incredible hair physics will see you on the next leg of our journey. Bye-bye.